morning everyone it's thursday we just finished yoga and had breakfast yoga i don't know I, I wasn't feeling it this morning to be honest it's cold i was doing a bit of a rush and yeah but that's okay we showed up we did our best and you can't really ask for more than that naturally we're leaving the yoga vibes on in the studio keeping it with this nice relaxing orange hue we're diving straight into our lessons we are learning about clip envelopes within ableton live today and then i think we have a project at the end of this and we're pretty much done unit six feeling pretty good about that which also means we are halfway through level two time's going by real quick but also at the same time i'm only on level two and i just started in the fall so i don't know i'm feeling a bit off today if I'm totally honest with you. Um, but it's the perfect time, rather than be creative, it's just to dive into the lessons and just do some work. All right, today is Thursday, which means we're posting the beginning of the week vlog. So if you haven't seen that yet, please go check it out right here. You know what? We said heck it today. We're staying in Zen mode all freaking day. Uh, you know, what is it? Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays are kind of my easier vlog days. Don't have any segments going on. Posting the vlog on Thursdays. So that's pretty much all we've been up to. Actually, that's a lot. We smashed out the rest of Unit 6, and all we have to do tomorrow is our assignment. And this time we are talking about clip envelopes. I'll probably show you some of that tomorrow for Future Friday because I think some of the stuff we learned is going to be really, really handy. Uh, it's freezing outside. My feet actually have felt cold all day. Yoga, I felt a bit off. So, you know what? We're just going to respect how we feel, cut ourselves some slack, head home early, probably play some Apex Legends. You know around here, we respect how we feel, we check in with ourselves, and if we're not feeling it, we're not going to force it. We've got to start our new mentor track for next week and we actually have to create a whole new track for this assignment the perfect little projects for friday saturday and sunday you know the drill tomorrow we get straight to unit six today is all about unit six we have this project to do where we have to use clip envelopes and some of the stuff is really really fascinating um the way that you can manipulate different envelopes different effects inside an individual clip but we got a project we basically have to create an entire two minute track utilizing this new information and that is what today is all about all right it's the end of the week let's finish off strong welcome back to another episode of future fridays future fridays is my vlog segment where i show you something that stood out for me at icon collective this week and this week we are working on clip envelopes this is a really, really handy tool for doing unique alterations with your sample packs, meaning you can actually take a generic sample pack and make it your own. Let me demonstrate. So let's drag in this white noise effect. Okay, I want this to be a riser instead, so I'm going to hit R to reverse it. And then I am going to pull in the fade handle and shorten it. So now it sounds like this. Actually, I'm going to shorten it even more. simple white noise effect straight out of the sample pack let's take a look inside so when you shorten it this little indicator start marker shows you exactly where it's playing so now you can go to this these two little dots down here show hide envelope box so here we go we're in our envelopes so we have these little device chooser and control chooser that at least that's what ableton's calling it so if we go into the mixer itself and let's say okay let's go with track volume let's go with let's zoom in a bit and let's hit b to bring up our pencil tool and let's just let's just dip out some audio here okay so we dip that out now all we gotta do is highlight this press command d or hold it and it duplicates and now we have some volume ducking let's check that out already sounds more creative uh, maybe let's go to the track panning up down or left and right let's see how that sounds i think this records in mono but it is 
Just trust me. It is going to the left and right. Realistically, if I bounce this out as my own, I've just created my own riser sample that is completely different and not even recognizable from the simple white noise riser that we had before. Yeah, okay, let's drag a snare roll in here. Boom. Let's actually start with transposition and let's, let's do this once it kind of picks up. Let's start with 12 and see how that sounds. For some reason this went to a different BPM, so let's bring it back. Okay, well we can't really hear what's going on, so let's smash that up to 24, and then let's bring this to start there. All right. Whoa, right? Like totally different energy there. So yeah, that's probably too high. So we might want to just do 12 and see how that sounds throughout. That sounds pretty good to me. So there's so many different things you can do with this. Not only can you do this on audio files, but you can do this on MIDI as well. Literally the exact same. So that is my tip to you on this Future Friday. Clip envelopes, whether that's MIDI or audio, really, really useful for not only making these audio sounds your own, but just getting more experimental with your automation and your modulation for your projects. We'll see you next time on Future Fridays. Hello. Now, I know what you're thinking. Bro, you've really let yourself go and overnight, but we had a little snowstorm situation in my little city on the west coast of Canada, Victoria, BC. Roll the footage. All right, everyone, call me crazy, but uh, I'm getting to the studio today. I got some real important stuff to do. And look at that. I mean, it's not that bad, right? Snow, 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 snow. The thing I love most about this is just how the snow blankets all the sound that a city usually makes. Everything's insulated and quieter and there's not very many cars or people. <laughs> and it's pretty. See, here's some gratitude. There's the plow right there in my hole. And now my walk is a little easier. <sighs> Gratitude in action, doing the work, trekking through the snow to get to the studio, and look what happens. I love it. Here's the part I was scared about the most. Woo! Almost got plowed. Going across this bridge, middle of the snowstorm. Actually, the workers are out, and the whole thing's already uh, shoveled. All right, we made it across the bridge. And now we're about five or so blocks. We're about half a block away, but yeah, all of this road is all compacted snow. My car would not do well, but we did it. So as you can see, things got a little crazy. So, but we trekked it into the studio. We've got a really important meeting this afternoon, which has to do with my secret project that I hinted towards a bunch of vlogs ago. Other than that, today we're just gonna get started on a vocal that is in my inbox, as well as my mentor track for next week, which we are actually gonna do a remix contest. There's a chance for a release on a really good label. So, I mean, I've done probably 50 remix contests, never won one, but it's the experience of doing that that counts. And I like doing them. We'll see how that goes today. We're definitely not doing a full studio day. We're here, we did it, we showed up. All right, we'll talk to you soon.